in this video we're going to be learning how percentage is applied to discount now discount as you know is basically when the seller reduces the price of a certain good or perhaps all goods for for whatever reason it could be due to uh, his seasonal sale it could be because the product is damaged or it could be just to generate more sale okay so we're not really interested uh, in in why discount is applied we're just interested in the percentage used behind applying a discount so we're gonna we're gonna understand percentage applied to discount with the help of an example one of them is the example right over here that i'm going to solve so as you can see here we have a sale in which there is 30 percent off all right so 30 percent is basically the percentage discount that we are getting so 30% is the percentage discount. Now, whenever we're working with discounts, there are a couple of things to watch out for. Now, the question can begin with giving you the price that's before the discount is applied, price before discount, in which case we'll have to work our way forward and apply the discount and work out the price that's after discount. In some cases, the question will give you that the price of the discount is applied in which case we'll have to work backwards and find out uh, what the price before discount is or perhaps we have we'll have to find out the amount of dollars that we're saving or the amount of uh, dollars that we're getting a discount of so in this case as you can see that this $800 right over here is the price before the discount and if we have to figure out the sale price, that means we have to work out the price after the discount. The meaning after 30% off is applied. So if we're getting 30% off, what that basically means is that the store is charging us 70%, right? That means the price has been reduced by 30%. So again, the way that I prefer to solve questions like these is that we're going we're gonna to make a column for percentage and we're going to make another column for dollars. So $800 is, you can say, the original price. So that means this $800 is equivalent to 100%. Now, 30% off means that now you will be paying 70% of the original price. So that means technically what you and I have to work out is what is 70% of 800 equal to. So we're going to write 70 and next to it we're going to write X. Now we can work this out very simply by cross multiplying. So 100 into X is equals to 70 times 800 so we're going to cross out the zeros 7 into 80 is equal to 560 dollars so that means the sale price or you can say that the price after the discount is basically equal to dollar 560 now in some cases the question may ask you that calculate how much uh, money do you save so we can we can work that out all we got to do is we got to take the difference of this 800 here and this 560 here so if we if we take out the difference of 800 and 560 so 800 minus 560 is basically equal to dollar 240 so this is the amount that we save or you can say that this is the amount of discount that you're getting 